today. It's our first official road trip travel in Italy. We're going to Lake Como. By the way, road trips in Italy is very, very expensive. You have to pay to use the highway, so there's tolls everywhere. You can't get rid of them unless you want to take the country roads, which takes a lot longer to get to your destination. All in one breath. <laughs> We are here and we found a parking right away. <laughs> so lucky. Now we're gonna go explore. So luckily we found a parking right away and now we are on our way to explore Bellagio, Lake Bellagio Como. <laughs> downtown area. And you know what, in Italy they just uh, changed the rules for COVID. Yes. We are supposed to keep a mask we does at all times but if you're outside you don't need to wear it which is fun last week oh shit it was a huge car it's a beautiful day we're exploring it's gonna be an 18 minutes walk from here to explore the downtown area so we're gonna get lost in the little streets but i mean come on we've been here. quarantined for two years yeah. yeah we were sitting on our couch for two years so let's walk for 18 minutes So we got excited there, you guys. We wanted to explore, but we're hungry. So we're gonna eat first. So I really wanna eat in this place. Prendiamo, facciamo quel, um, quell'antipasto che ci hai detto. Il sottino? Ah, ma non ho visto i secondi. Sì. Sì. Abbiamo calamari, gamberoni alla griglia, non filato di sempre rimanendo in tema lago, abbiamo il salmerino. Allora, questo? I ravioli al salmerino, che dicevi? Tagliolini perché a me piace. Tagliolini con le mongole? Sì, dai. Ok, guys, so this is what we got for lunch. Fabio, tell us, what's for lunch today? So this is... I forgot the name of the fish. Missoltino. Ok. So this is missoltino, dried out and with sweet polenta because this is quite salty typical of the lake typical of this lake <laughs> so this is just for our appetizer and there's a rule to eat this appetizer so the rule is first you eat the fish because it's salty and then you eat the polenta which is sweet i already packed it up because <laughs> i ate the polenta <laughs> Go. Oh my god, you are going to love this. So this, in the Philippines, this is a very typical dish for us. This is our typical meal, fried fish. <laughs> it's true though. So what is it? Fish polenta. Fish polenta. With the tail too. Mm. I know. This is a Filipino dish. To you. <laughs> it's dried fish, isn't it? Yeah. Which why is it so bougie in Italy and in the Philippines, this is what we eat every day. The polenta balances out because polenta is kind of like bland and the fish is too salty and this wine is exclusive from this region so it's Lugana Lugana, it's beautiful So our main courses are here <laughs> So the main courses are here This is a homemade linguine Linguine? No, tagliolini. Homemade pasta with clams. And that one is with a specific lake um, fish, which is very similar to salmon. And look at that, it's delicious. This is the first bite. It's my first bite. 
They said it's salmon inside. Tortellini with salmon inside. Local lake salmon in this area. <gasps> I want a bit of the sauce. Bitch, look at the sauce. It's so nice. Mm. You must try this. Mm. This is also homemade. Wait, because I, I need to roll it properly. Yes. Give me a, a second. Here. Wow. Mm. Delicious. Is it good? Mm. Delicious. And we'll finish it off with coffee. Mm. Okay, so now we're gonna explore. What's the name of the town? Bellagio. <laughs> so now we're gonna explore Bellagio. So it looks like this town is literally this whole stairs. <laughs> this is the whole town. <laughs> Look, let's, let's go there to the fountain so we show them. It's drinking water too. So Fabio, what can you say about this town? It's our first time both you and I exploring this town. It's beautiful. It's a typical lake town. Very picturesque, very nice. I love it. Food is amazing. Expensive, but amazing. The town is really not that big, so we're almost done exploring. But it's so nice, these small little streets. This is what I always look for when I come to an Italian town. It's just so pretty. Hotel. So Lake Como is this long lake in the middle, in north of Italy and around the lake there's a lot of small little towns and Bellagio, which is this town, is one of them. So there's a lot more but I think this is one of the prettier ones but I also read the other one is pretty. What's the name of the other one? If you guys decide to come over here to stay overnight, there's a lot of hotels in the town. So Fabio, tell us, how was your first time in Bellagio? Lake Como. Bellagio. Oh, Bellagio. <laughs> oh, that's what the other one is. The other one is Minaggio. I heard Minaggio is beautiful as well, that one right there. So yeah, how's your first Anyways, time? Anyways, it was beautiful guys. It's a lovely town, it's very chill. Today was not full of tourists because it's in the middle of the week, so we were very lucky. Zero traffic to drive here, so it took very little time. And honestly, look at this, how beautiful. That pretty much concludes our day in Bellagio, right? Bellagio. 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 It was beautiful. If you have a time, come visit. It's northern of Italy, close to Lake Como. There's a lot of other towns near Lake Como you can explore. But today, this is the only thing we could do because the other towns are, are all the way the other side of the lake. So that means we have to go around the lake to go to the nearest, greatest cities to explore. <laughs> Bye, Bye, guys! See you in the next adventure.